Hi everyone, welcome back to Electronics Geek. I am Ajay. So today we have two opportunities for the electronics and electrical candidates. And we are also going to see what you need to add in your resume and how you need to update your resume. So if you are new to our channel, please like and subscribe to our YouTube channel. So let's begin with today's update. First opportunity we have is from Revoice. They are hiring for the Silicon Verification Intern for the Bangalore location. So if you have a bachelor's degree, master's degree or PhD in electronics or electrical, then you guys can easily apply for this opportunity. Okay, and here the requirement is like you should know in depth about the digital logic design, CPU, SOC architecture and micro architecture. And it will be good if you have the knowledge of system very log or experience knowledge of C, C++ or relevant knowledge of verification methodologies. And it will be plus if you know the formal verification methodologies like UVM and all and any one of the scripting languages like Python, TCL. Okay, so if you want to be a verification engineer, then these are the basic requirement for any such role. So how you need to update your resume. So make sure whenever you apply for any opportunities you need to check the requirement of the companies and here you can see the basic requirement so you need to add these things in your resume as well in this skill section you will be adding a uh, c c plus plus system very log uvm or tcl or python scripting languages plus there should be a projects relevant to your skills so that it can showcase okay whatever the skills you have it also prove that you have implemented those skills by using the project and if you have done any certification you can add certification part as well and finally uh, if you have the github profile then you can add whatever the projects you made so this is how you need to update your resume and if you need any help you can always connect with me on one to one resume building session the link will be in the description okay so let's see how you can apply for this just click on apply for the job and just fill out the basic details first you need to upload your resume then your name email id and here links you can share your github link or your linkedin profile link and in the additional information you can just copy paste your cover letter and if you don't know how to make a cover letter so just comment cover letter i will provide you the cover letter sample so just uh, copy paste it here uh, you need to just change the small things uh, as per your requirement then you can directly copy paste it here and just click on submit application okay and if you find any difficulties you can comment it below so moving on to the next opportunity that is from the microsoft they are hiring for the hardware engineering intern for the multiple locations in across india when wherever their offices are present the qualification requirement is currently pursuing a master degree in electrical computer science or electronics and this is for 2026 batch only so if you are 2026 then you can apply for the microsoft and here this skills requirement is like you should have the knowledge of embedded programming or c c plus plus or c has so these are the basic requirement and make sure you should update your resume as per the requirement of the companies as well and if you have made some projects related to the embedded c or c has embedded so then it will be plus for you okay so all the links will be in the description as well as in the comment section from there you guys can easily apply and if you need any help related to the resume you guys can always connect with me on one to one resume building session link will be in the descriptions and for cover letter just comment cover letter i will share you the link okay and for more updates you can join our telegram group i will see you in the next video till then take care stay safe and keep applying for a job all the best bye bye